Hey guys, Danny Johnson here, and today we're going to be covering the new uh, site stripe linking. If you have an Amazon affiliates page, you may have noticed that uh, your links may no longer work. So this is the way to fix that. Uh, basically, if you log into Amazon affiliates, you'll see your information here. As you can see, mine dropped pretty much to zero revenue. <laughs> I even went negative because uh, I had a return but uh, the links that I have are no longer working. And so the way that they want you to fix this is with their new site stripe feature. So in Amazon Associates, when you click on it, it's kind of hard to follow here because all it is explaining is that you're no longer gonna do it from your Amazon Associates like you used to. What it's saying is now log into Amazon normally as if you were gonna buy something and it should come up here as a little site stripe bar at the top with some text and uh, we'll go over a few examples. It's really important as well, go ahead and click on um, the site stripe learn more. You want to make sure that it's turned on. So right here you can see it says display status is enabled. Make sure that's on or you won't see it. Uh, so now what we're going to do is open up a brand new window and we're going to do it under just Amazon.com. Okay, So you're not logging into your Amazon affiliates page. So at the top, as you can see now, it will say Amazon Associate Site Stripe, okay, and that's at the top, and it'll say Get Link with Text. So for example, we're going to go to a car part that I use often, the Moog Pitman Arm. So when I click on that, I'm searching it just as if I was uh, on Amazon. Make sure you're logged in, and it shows your information. So here's the product. I'm going to go ahead and click on it. And so now, up at the top left, you'll see Amazon Associates Site Stripe, and you'll see Get Link. And so it'll have the text right here. We're going to go ahead and click on that. And so when you do, now it's going to show you on the top left uh, that link that you would be getting in the past for your Amazon Associates. Okay, so you're going to make sure you copy that. And that link is different than the one that is on there. I, my old links appeared to still be working, but I do not believe they're linking anymore, so you have to do this. So we're going into where I have this uh, part listed here, and so um, basically I'm going, going to paste the new link, okay, and then delete my old one uh, here. And so um, by doing that, we're going to go ahead and save it. We're going to go back into the video, and we're going to go ahead and test it. So um, here's where that part is now found, and when I click on it, uh, the part does come up so it appears to be working uh, they do have a site checker as well on your Amazon Associates page um, that you can try to put it in so anyway um, thanks for watching please subscribe to the channel if you're new hopefully this video is helpful thanks guys